The eye is a complex and fascinating sensory organ that allows us to see the world around us. It works much like a camera, capturing light and converting it into electrical signals that are sent to the brain. Here's a breakdown of the eye's structure and anatomy outer layer sclera, the tough, white outer coat of the eye that protects its inner workings. It also provides attachment points for the extraocular muscles that move the eye. Or near the transparent dome-shaped structure at the front of the eye, it covers the iris and pupil and helps to focus light entering the eye. The cornea is the strongest and most sensitive part of the outer layer. Conjunctiva, a thin mucous membrane that lines the eyelid and sclera and helps to lubricate and protect the eye. Middle layer choroid, a dark, pigmented layer that nourishes the eye and absorbs excess light. It contains many blood vessels that supply the eye with oxygen and nutrients, ciliary body, a muscular ring that controls the shape of the lens, allowing the eye to focus on near and far objects. Iris, the colored part of the eye that controls the amount of light entering the eye by adjusting the size of the pupil. The iris is like the diaphragm of a camera. In a layer. Retina, the light sensitive layer of the eye that contains millions of photoreceptor cells called rods and cones. Rods allow us to see in low light, while cones allow us to see color and detail. The retina converts light into electrical signals that are sent to the brain through the optic nerve, optic nerve, optic nerve, a bundle of nerve fibers that carries electrical signals from the retina to the brain, where they are interpreted as vision and other important parts. Pupil, the dark opening in the center of the iris that controls the amount of light entering the eye. The pupil gets larger in low light to allow more light in and smaller in bright light to prevent too much light from entering. Lens a transparent, flexible structure that focuses light rays onto the retina. The ciliary body changes the shape of the lens to allow us to focus on near and far objects. Aqueous humor a clear, fluid-filled chamber between the cornea and the lens. Vitreous humor a clear, jelly-like substance that fills the main cavity of the eyeball and helps to maintain its shape. By working together, all of these parts allow us to see the world in all its color and detail.